So I'm gonna try something. All right. So these Noor sides, my doesn't really matter. But let's say the broccoli cheese. They really want you to use vegetable oil and butter, and that's how you get your best flavor, and that makes perfect sense with the rice. So, when I was thinking, what is vegetable? What is a buttery, a buttery vegetable oil? <laughs> Popcorn. <laughs> so I'm gonna use this with these for my main dishes. I think it's a great idea, <laughs> to be honest. So I just got a ride from Dewey. Man, what an awesome dude he was. Uh, and uh, showed me around town, and I kind of hope to come back someday and do some kayaking and fishing with him. Uh, cool guy. Now, so that's a YMCA. I can, um, the camping area is around here. So, I don't know what I did in my last video, but I was gonna stay at the motel for another night, but they doubled the rate. So, I'm not sure what to do I'm supposed to get. But they doubled the rate, so I'm sleeping outdoors. I really don't need a motel that much. So, I'm camped at uh, some YMCA campground down the road here by some abandoned uh, factories. <laughs> down by the river <laughs> it's cool so I'm just going back to my campsite and uh, some older lady just started talking to me as I'm walking by just the sweetest woman but she was uh, she's complaining about the, her telling me this story about this six year battle with uh, a ground dog <laughs> living in their yard and uh <laughs> it's hilarious. I wish I should start recording this, but then people wouldn't tell me the story, you know. So I, I it, it, it wouldn't happen. So she just keeps telling me a story about this. She said the uh, neighbor, a new person across the street, said, "Hey, what kind of dog is that you got over there?" And she goes, "I ain't got no dog. That's a groundhog." And <laughs> I guess it's huge. So. We were just talking about that, talking about everything for like 20 minutes I'm standing there. She's just, it was cool. But uh, I just turn around and walk away and she goes, hey, 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 come here. And I turn around the corner, there's that groundhog. It was huge. <laughs> I don't know what it's been living off of, but she's trying to trap it. But yeah, it was huge. It was the size of a dog. <laughs> she wasn't kidding. <laughs> That's funny. So here's the township. And the YMCA you kind of run this. And uh, this is for through hikers. And that's nice. And uh, so there I am. Had a lot of help in uh, Waynesboro. Everybody's really nice here. I got a ride last night, and then we got a ride from a trail angel, Judy, and she's totally sweet. Picked us up from the Mosetta and I did. Picked us up from the uh, camping field in town, and uh, we're stopping at Kroger, and. Um, I had to get some new water bottles. And I'm going back on the trail. And uh, I'm probably going to do a ton of miles today. Feel really good. Hi, Joey. <laughs> so I just entered the Shenandoah National Park. I'm excited. <laughs> Everybody says this is one of the best parts of the trail. And uh, I'm very excited. 
Uh, thanks, Judy, for for uh, dropping us off. And uh, uh, she picked us up from uh, there's a campground in the city in uh, Waynesboro. And uh, it's just for through hikers. It's kind of cool. And uh, dropped us off here. And, uh, I don't know how far I'm going to go today, but pretty far probably. It's just the uh, weather is awesome. Nice breeze. It's going to be hot though. So we'll see. That might slow me down. Bears, 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 bears. <laughs> Gonna be bears in here. <laughs> Could be some awesome views too. Damn, I don't like going through stuff like that. Especially in Shenandoah's. But yeah. Hiker just told me that uh, he just passed a rattlesnake. He said about a half a mile. So the last hiker I just passed said the snake, the rat, the rattler's rattle was out on the trail rattling. Now let me show you <laughs> what the what the trail looks like right now, so you can see how nervous I get on this kind of stuff. Wait, I watch. <laughs> This is my vision. <laughs> the hell of it is, everything looks like a rattlesnake. And you can't see anything off the trail because of the grass. Look at that. Shenandoahs. Oh, beautiful. It's getting really pretty. Getting really pretty. Hi there, bunny. Huh. What are you doing? <laughs> huh? Are you a little lost? You look healthy. Hmm. You're a funny guy. So, uh, that rabbit was really not much afraid of me. <laughs> I tried to walk out, walk up a little closer, and it moved away, but, uh, I don't know. It might be the National Park, you know? It didn't seem, uh, didn't seem sick or anything, it looked fairly healthy, it was acting normal. It just wasn't that afraid of me. <laughs> and, uh, I just hope the bears aren't like that. <laughs> but I hear they kind of are. Uh, it's kind of a bad situation, really. <laughs> so, interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> this is a really bad spot. <laughs> I mean, I got the only spot. I want a rock on it. But look at this hillside. Hmm, <laughs> there's the shelter. There. Back to the trail. Bear box, though. It's right there. So, it's cool. <laughs> Some kids out here. <laughs> it's a weekend. Okay. The bunny rabbits are just, like, tame here. <laughs> I can't believe it. This is the shit of Noah's people. The bunny rabbits are tame. It's like it's like a Disney movie. Yeah, this is a wild bunny. <laughs> I it's almost like people must feed them. I don't know. They are not afraid of people. Isn't that freaking adorable? You'd think with two to four bears per square mile they'd be afraid of everything. But 
apparently not. I want to pet it. I wonder if I can, like, pretend I got, I got food. He's looking. Like, yeah, people feed me. Hey, come to my campsite later, I guess. Do you like oranges? <laughs> no? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> That's too cute. I'm gonna try to get closer. It's okay. I am so close now. I am so close. <laughs> oh, I'm basically on the it's slanted. <laughs> Can't tell. It's slanted. It's rocky. <sighs> it's not good. <laughs> this whole place is bad, but it's the Shenandoahs. It's gorgeous. And the rabbits aren't afraid of people. They're pretty tame. I mean, come on. <laughs> this place is awesome. So using the popcorn butter flavored oil <laughs> winning combination oh my god it's delicious <laughs> I forget what flavor I have <clears throat> um because <clears throat> I don't know if it'll work with everything but hold on let's see I thought I'd get one that would work yes cheddar broccoli that is really really good <laughs> that is really good so I bought one of those large bottles of uh uh, popcorn butter and um, then I went and bought a couple little travel size of mouthwash at uh, Dollar General or something I don't remember where and I just went in the bathroom washed those out and then came out and then filled those with the uh, popcorn butter and so I have two small little things <laughs> probably last me forever because you put about yeah actually I probably put two tablespoons probably a little bit more than I should but this is a lot. That's like two full cups of rice. So that's a full meal right there for me. But yes, <laughs> delicious. That's cheap. That's a really good cheap meal. So that works. That freaking works. It's really, really good. So, you know, kind of experiment. <laughs> so I'm basically on the side of a hill tonight. And here, this, this... This is a tree. <laughs> uh, I put my tent here, so um, so I just roll against that tree. This is the worst campsite ever. There's a there's a. I wanted to stay here because I just didn't want problems with bears. And uh, there's a bear box here, so you can lock your food in it. But then somebody's got a five pound roast in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god I don't know it didn't it didn't seem to smell right now but man a couple days bears are gonna come from miles around <laughs> good morning from the Appalachian Trail <laughs> that's a whippoorwill and uh he did this all night. <laughs>